I'm here at the Yojo Outlet headquarters in Cincinnati, Ohio, and we have something different today. Uh, you know, here, here on the shelves, we are, there's G.I. Joes, and there's Transformers, and there's Spiral Zone, and Thundercats, and Silverhawks, and all kinds of, you name it. Um, but there are no Tarzan the Epic Adventure figures by Trend Masters in 1995. So this is a unique, out of I mean, thousands of, of toys in here, rare European Starcom figures. We don't have Tarzan the Epic Adventures, Edgar Rice Burroughs, Tarzan Conqueror of Mars, bendable figure. We certainly don't have Plant Man, the vicious Martian monster. Um, I actually own uh, this guy here. His name's Omadzad, and I own Leopard Man. Uh, they're bendy figures, and that's what's weird. And they, they um, sometimes you'll find them in a bin, like at the flea market for a dollar or two. Don't pay three for that. That'd be crazy. Um, sometimes they'll pop up like on, on ID or action figure ID websites. Um, I went with this guy. There was two. There was him, and there was this uh, dinosaur guy, which that's not what the production one looks like. It look, looks very different. Um, this guy doesn't have any accessories, but he's he's a lot cooler looking. I mean, he's something that I wouldn't mind having on the shelf here. So uh, we're going to open this up. I'm kind of wondering what that thing is. It looks like a stand, but I also think it's like a belt clip or something. So I might, might attach it to my shorts here. Um, also, you know, be careful when you're opening these. If you do open these, I know they're, they're very valuable. Um, don't let that, that fool you. This, this does not cost me $5. Um, there's one Tarzan point right there. It's a proof of purchase. You can mail those in for, for rare, exclusive mail-in Tarzan, the Epic Adventure figures. Um, so yeah, let's, let's, let's bust this guy open. Set this aside so I can mail in my Tarzan points. All right. So here he is. What's his name, Plant Man? And yeah, he's bendy. And he's got some dreadlocks, and he's got some weird claw hands. And he's got like a shark tail, which makes no sense. Um, but yeah, he's a, he's a bendy guy. And then here, we got to do this little doodad here. This is where the real value lies in this figure. You might think it's a figure stand, but you'd be wrong. Um, I guess. I mean, I guess you can like put that on like a backpack or it's like a badge, like I'm an official. Tarzan, or can maybe throw it up there. Yeah, there we go. I guess if I had like a, a, a pocket shirt, a breast pocket, I could put it there so I can wear it around. I can get um, beat up and bullied and pushed into a locker in, in school. Um, so yeah, there's Plant Man, the shark tail and, and dreadlocks. I never really read Tarzan. Uh, not really, Not really my thing, but Kind of a cool figure. He's definitely going to go go on the shelf. This thing, um, it's going to go straight in the garbage. And um, yeah, I'm hoping to collect some more of these because this is a cool line. But um, I'll save up those, those Tarzan points to to get me some uh, some exclusive, rare mail-in Tarzan epic adventures figures.